Now, what is the relevance of infrastructure? I mean, you may say, how are all these things relevant to me? Or for that matter, any country. The relevance of infrastructure is by no means to be undermined. You can take anything. Let's say we were talking about agriculture. Now in agriculture, if the infrastructure is not available, there are no R&D institutes, etc. How will you get good seeds? The transportation. Let's say you import seeds. If the infrastructure is not there, can you import seeds? Selling produce. Is it possible if transportation facilities are not there? Fertilizers. I mean, if you live in a village which is thousand miles from the city and you don't have any means to go to the city, how will it, you get these fertilizers to do the agricultural production? Once you get all these, basically your ag ability to do agriculture improves up and as it improves, your production goes up. Similarly, you can also say that, let's say for health, I mean, if good infrastructure is not available in respect of hospitals, what will happen? No hospitals, people will get sick and they die. So again, this infrastructure of hospital is very important. Let's take the case of services. Again, I've repeated this two times earlier. If good schools are not available, will you get good people to work in the service industry? How do you get good people? If telecom is not available, how you, do you earn foreign exchange through BPOs? So, so infrastructure is all pervasive. Without infrastructure, it's not that these activities will not take place, but it definitely improves the quality of everything that is done. I mean, let's say for example, if you don't have transport, you might not be able to import seeds. You will use certain seeds, but the production will be low. So it's not that people did not survive till the time these things were not there, but once you got this infrastructure in terms of transportation, the ships, that were used to import these seeds. Obviously the production went up. If when the hospitals are not there, you had these traditional people who are called Veds in India, who used to cure people through Ayurvedic medicines. They were also relevant. They were definitely relevant, but for certain critical diseases, you have to go to the cities services well this is something which is still evolving and has to evolve so really i mean again education is something because of the advent of the technology today sitting at your home if you have a broadband which is a given thing from telecom you can study anything you have satellite classes you have so many things which you can do which you were not able to do earlier let me tell you one simple example today there are companies which are through the internet are teaching a large number of US students. Right? But definitely the as the infrastructure improves, the quality of all these things also improve.